Hello everyone, for those who I haven't met, my name's Essie and I'm lucky enough to have known George, also known as the Groovy Jeb at Hotmail.com, Hoss, g and Mad Dog as the greatest friend I'll ever have. Now to the main man, my new husband Clinton, who looks, he looks very handsome tonight. I'm so grateful that you came shoulder rolling into my life all those years ago. Um, I, was, I met Clint um, playing footy at Hammersley Kareen and across that uh, illustrious career at Hammersley, he's one of the few people that's been about, able to maintain a career of more spoils and possessions. The, the back of my head can attest to his uh, spoiling ability as there's still indents from him not wanting to lose a contest so he'd rather punch a mate in the back of the head. I've been waiting 25 years for this moment and 20 years to whip out this bad boy. I truly hope these quotes give you an insight to just how profoundly romantic and poetic your wife is. I'm sweet as heaven, hot as hell, I'm the finest girl, as you can tell. If you ask me to blink every time I thought of you, I might as well keep my eyes closed. But Clint, you've got to be careful with this one. I'm a cutie with a booty, I'm a hottie with a body, and I'm a honey with your money. As I said earlier, it was Christmas 2013 when we first became aware of Clint. Well-mannered and respectful, it was easy to like Clint from the start. He even shared my taste in hairstyle. <laughs> Months grew into years and time went by, we came to know what a terrific guy Clint is. This is a bloke who volunteers his time weekly to man the phones at Lifeline. Full credit to you, Clint. I've recently had a daughter. One of my greatest dreams is that she, like me, gets the chance to find her very own Georgia. Better yet, possess some of the qualities she has. Uniquely, she's the only person I know that can make me laugh during moments of sadness. Delivering a card which read, I'm sorry for your loss, and a box of chocolates to me one afternoon. While she always has good intentions, her timing was a little off. My Nana was still Earthside, and the box of celebrations really hit the spot. <laughs> Georgia and Clint, I wish you a lifetime of laughter, travel and the most happiest memories to come. You've both built a life together to be proud of and you truly make the world a better place. Please raise your glasses, charge them up for G-Babes and Clinton Lee. Thank you all very much for being here to celebrate a day that was a long, long, long time in the making. All the people in this room are just so special to us and we couldn't imagine celebrating today without you all. Just on a slightly more serious note, myself and all the guests here today are so proud of how you two have handled the ups and downs of this year. If I can only look in admiration of how you've got through it. Um, <laughs> sorry. Um, Wayne, um, Wayne loved you, Georgia, and he was so proud bringing you into this family, and, and Sue would have as well. So they'd be so proud of Clint, the man you are, and, and the woman you've chose to spend your life with. So. everyone and welcome to the beautiful assembly yard where we are here today to celebrate the wedding of Clint and Georgia. Of mind, of we 
to re-echo from the start. Oh, I still can't believe how lucky I am that I get to wake up next to that little face every day. You're worth every single one of the hoops you made me jump through early days in our relationship. You're intelligent, you're caring, you're ridiculously good looking, and definitely in the top two funniest people in our relationship. When times get tough, there's no one else I'd rather have in my corner, and when times are great like today, there's no one else I'd want to share them with. I look forward to a lifetime of being the president of the Georgia Bevis Fan Club, and trying to convince you of just how amazing you are every day. I love you, Buzz. This is what, this is what, this is what it all comes down to. Where you need, where you need, where you need to let it all. Shout it out and release it from the heart This year has been testing in many ways. However, your positive outlook on life did not skip a beat. I admire your ability to continuously look to what you have as opposed to what you might have lost or be missing. I'm very lucky to have someone by my side that is always on my team. You're the first person that I want to tell exciting things to and the last thing I want to see before I go to bed. I love you.